Greetings everyone, Blashow here, and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 2. And I'm still in Forley, still doing side activities, and I hope I won't find any more chests. Even if I find them, I'm gonna ignore them to avoid, or rather to limit a risk of getting another crash. Even though they happen in various moments. Okay, where are those guards? In the city or...? Yeah, most are in the city. That kind of irritated me that they spotted me like literally a single second and that's what that was needed. I'm not touching freaking Oh, 
Hmm, okay, that was okay. Again, the question remains like how many contracts can this place have? I hope not many. And the only problem is that getting to this one is more problematic. Another without being seen. Okay, that's gonna be tough. <laughs> are available here. If you've no stomach for luxury, you had best turn away. Come, come, don't be shy. I have served dukes, princes, kings. Only the most well-heeled grace this boot. <laughs> <laughs> that bad of thing. Honestly, I'm thinking that I might go for this one because it's easier to get. But it's still closer, so I suppose.
Where do you think you're going? <laughs> Up here. Lee, not you. Which one? After him. Hurry. But you, there, there, get him. I pity your foes, amigo. Hmm, again? Okay. I have devotion as the only god party. I have scores of new words from excitement on my Well, aren't you a funny monkey? What do I have? Uh, actually, not many things. I've only the highest. I'll just count it again. Really? No place to jump. No hay, no nothing.
Oof. Remind me, are there any more? Yes, sir. Give me a horse, any horse. Question is, is the agent in the city? Yes, it is. Are you serious? I got him? I suppose. Thank you. 
Kışı iyi falan. Ya. tight. Please tell me that was the last right. one. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Maybe I would hope so. Yeah. 
Oh, let's see if this one will not crush my game. No. No, really, fuck me. Okay, we are all the way up here. Myself again. That's interesting. Yes, that was the last one. All right. Therefore, time to go. And hopefully, the game will aye, aye. not crash. I mean, there are various bugs, I suppose. Hmm. 
Nothing can be done. Be careful, Ezio. Do you know who that was? My next conquest. <laughs> uh, I don't think so, Ezio. That's Caterina Sforza, daughter of the Duca di Milano. Her husband is... Husband? See, si, her husband is the Lord of Forli. That woman is as powerful and dangerous as she is young and beautiful. Sempre come una donna per me. Everything all right? Better than all right. You're making amazing progress. Amazing's quite a strong word. Then why are we stopping? Prolonged exposure to the Animus can have, uh, side effects. <laughs> awesome. It's nothing to worry about. You haven't shown any of the symptoms. Symptoms? What symptoms? Degradation of cognition, temporal hallucinations, multiple awareness issues, overlapping realities, you know. So, what you're saying is... What we're saying, Desmond, is if you're not careful, you may not need the Animus to visit with your ancestors. Which wouldn't be a bad thing, assuming you could control it. Up until now, though, no one has. Subject 16. We have safeguards, Desmond. And they kept him in the Animus for way too long, sometimes days at a time. We're being careful with you. I hope so. Anyway, I was hoping we could test out your skill retention. See if you've picked up some of Ezio's abilities. I'm game. Great. Meet me downstairs when you're ready. What could 16 have found that needs so much secrecy and security? Well, I don't know, do I? Lucy thinks it's something about the Codex, but I'm not so sure. I'm all ears if it's as life-changing as Sixteen says. Blimey, if I was allowed to use the Animus, I'd be the one in there finding out. Instead, as usual, I'm forced to sit here on the sidelines. Really? No dialogue with her? Okay. So what's the plan? We're gonna see what you've managed to retain. Come on! Abstergo's out there, looking for us. They're better funded and better equipped, so it's only a matter of time before they find this place. We need to be ready for them when they do. I want you to activate the warehouse's defense system. I'll let you figure out how to reach the sensors. Oh, come on. Not even a hint? Open your eyes, Desmond. Lucy, I'm seeing things. Do the hallucinations last longer than 30 seconds? No. Then it's nothing to be worried about. It'll pass. So, how am I doing? You've picked up every single one of Ezio's skills. The adoption rate is fantastic. Another day or two and we'll be done. You gotta tell me, 
Why Ezio? Why Italy? I mean, we could have just gone back to Altair again. Followed him during his early years. It started with 16. Ah, good old Subject 16. He repainted my room, you know. With his blood. I'd been going through his files. Vidic flagged a couple of his Animus sessions. A bunch of different ancestors, different dates and locations. Ancient Africa, the Middle East. But towards the end, he became obsessed with Italy. I think he knew about the vault. A few of the records of his later Animus sessions are missing. And the sessions that are there... After everything the Templars put him through, after everything I put him through, it's all scrambled. If we hadn't pushed 16 so hard, we'd have the answers already. And maybe he'd still be alive. So you're after the Codex and the Vault. I knew you had an ancestor in Italy who was at the center of all of this. Alright, I think we're done for the day. You should get some rest. Lucy, what happened to Sixteen wasn't your fault. You were just as much a prisoner as I was. Thanks. Good night, Desmond. I'm glad you're here. What the hell? What is this? Where am I? It's Acre. Altair. Hmm. That must be his target. I must have passed out. Just having some kind of weird dream. Going without sleep, who knows how long. Guess I shouldn't be surprised.
It shows it's not animals because we didn't die. Issues of surprisingly simple thing. Sorry for that. And of course I bugged out the, the lamb. Just now freaking the fuck out. So literally this is the only way and I cannot fucking figure it out. Finally, Jesus. I guess I was just approaching it from a wrong direction. Sorry to barge in on you like this, but it's getting late and we were... Hey, you okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, all good. Weird dreams, that's all. Alright. I'll let you get ready. See you in a few. Ah, good of you to join us. Sorry. Long night. What a professional, what a professional approach. Leave him alone. Well, you'll forgive me if I want to get some actual work done. Oh, madness, isn't it? Sean! Please, that's enough. All right. Uh, 
Hey. Uh, hi. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Everything's fine. You sure? We lost two more teams last night. That's eight more of us, just... gone. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do anymore. It just keeps getting worse and worse. Hey, remember what you told me? You gotta have faith. And look, here we are, safe and sound. <laughs> For how long? And when they find us? Then what? When that happens, if that happens, we'll deal with it. I'll keep you safe. Anyway, enough with my little breakdown. I should get back to work. And so should you. Yeah, right. I should have expected that, that he's, you know, grumpy Brit. Okay. Seems like work it is. Okay, I'm gonna start the sequence and then I'm really gonna call it for today. I'm down. I should have just like went up. Ben arrivato. I am Elvise. Senor Donna has asked that I escort you to the workshop. Are you ready? Ah, Venezia. What are the... place is as beautiful, as stable, as perfect. I will show you her wonders. Our first stop, the Rialto Bridge. Behold the elegance with which she spans the Grand Canal, a symbol of Venetian unity and pride. Let us continue. Here we are, San Giacomo di Rialto, oldest church in Venezia. Isn't she beautiful? And her clock tower, magnifico. Come, come, there's more to see. No other city can match the size of Venezia's markets. Be it spices or silk, from near and far, 
There is. There is. You were told to stay home. But the rent is paid. I have every right to sell here. Emilio disagrees. No, no, stop, stop. Let us continue the tour elsewhere. Look, isn't it amazing? Would you mind buying it for me? I have... I left my money with my bags. Hey! Mind your step, Corleone! Here we have the Palazzo della Seta, home to Emilio Barbarigo. Normally I'd suggest a closer look, but... but the way things are now... Why? What's happened? He is attempting to unify the merchants beneath a single banner. There's been resistance. Some of it violent. What kind of resistance? They say they're fighting for the people. For freedom or some such nonsense. But Giannate, if you ask me. They destroyed my stand. I demand compensation. Here you are, then. <clears throat> the Doge will know about this. I'll report you to the Council. Good luck with that, my friend. What are you doing? You're under arrest for disrupting commerce. What? You just invented that. There's no such law. There is now. No, stop! And now, I present to you your workshop, Ser Da Vinci. We spared no expense in its design. You'll see, it is perfect, as if you never left Firenze. I wish you great success, and hope you enjoy Venezia as much as she enjoys having you. So, here we are. Exciting, isn't it? Care to come in? It may be later. I need to visit the Palazzo della Seta. Try and gain an audience with Emilio. As you wish. But should you find yourself with free time, or another Codex page, don't hesitate to visit. My door is always open. Grazie, my friend. Di nulla. I, I clicked, I just reacted too, too slowly. Leonardo! Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha! <laughs> you found another one! How exciting! This one's easy. You just move every other letter. Here! Okay. Uh... Yeah, we have some watchtowers. Yeah, this is gonna have to wait. For now, thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, episode. It's gonna be one super long one. And I will see you guys next time. Later.